Coleman. No, no. Lovely. Thanks, Brendan. No problem. No problem. And our things. Morning. Oh, good, good. So just. So just to say, first thing, just give me your name first and stand up beside me here because. Thank you. No red light. So welcome back now, ladies and gentlemen. We're just after Mass been celebrated by Bishop Column, and we have some more friends and guests here who would like to send their wishes to all the loved ones abroad. The first person I have beside me here is uh, Roshan McHugh. That's, of course, Roshan and Peter who's sitting down there. So Roshan, maybe just stand up here beside me, if you would, please. And you're going to send wishes to whom, Roshan? My sister Angela in Toronto and her husband, PJ. Just look at this man over here, Roshan. Uh, to my sister <laughs> Angela and her husband, Peter, in Toronto, um, their son, Michael, a daughter, Ursula, and her husband, Anthony, and the wee girl, Madeline, who had a birthday this week, and uh, her daughter, Tara, and Patrick, Ava, and James, and sending her love from all of us here. Uh, happy St. Patrick's Day. Thank you very much indeed, Roshan. Happy Patrick's Day to you. Now, next we have coming up here to send her wishes to whom? Uh, Mary McManus. Mary McMahon. How are you, Mary? And you're sending your wishes to? Uh, Trevor Canning and Andrew Canning in London, my nephews. Trevor and Andrew in London, yeah. and wish them a happy Patrick's Day. Yeah. And are you going to be on the town today, uh, Mary? No, not really. Not no. today, no. okay. Thank you very much indeed. Happy yeah. Patrick's Day to you. So next we have Anna Connolly coming up here. Anna, how are you? Uh, Anna Connolly Sheridan, should I say, my apologies. <laughs> Anna, and you're sending wishes to, if you just look at the red light, please. I'm Ooh. sending wishes to my grandson in Perth in Australia. Happy St. Patrick's Day, Robbie, and I'll be thinking about you. I'm going to drown the shamrock now, so I hope you do the same. Don't drown too much until I join you. Thanks very much, indeed, and a happy Patrick's Day to you. Now, next we have uh, Maureen Don. How are you, Maureen? I'm very well, Brendan, thank you. I want to send special St. Patrick's Day wishes to my sister, Patricia Roach, and her husband, Christopher, and their two daughters, Hannah and Claire, in Melbourne, Australia. Hope to see you soon for Orla's wedding. God bless. Bye-bye. Thank you very much, indeed, Maureen. A happy Patrick's Day to you. Now, next we have coming up here another lady. How are you? How are you? I'm very dear. How are you? I'd like to send a um, special greeting to my sister. Ursula and her husband Phil in Australian Stroud, and um, to her two sons and, and Kieran's wife Claire. Happy St. Patrick's Day. Can I join you and send uh, special wishes to Ursula as well? Because yeah. I would have known Ursula yeah, in, our, in, our, in our younger days. Yeah. Thank you very much, Dean, and happy Patrick's Day to you. And next we have coming up here to send wishes to somewhere. Is it in Ireland, England, America? Where are we going? New York? Yeah, and the name again is? It's um, Adrian Ronan and Fidelma Bartley and, and Gareth Megan. So. Uh, uh, that's all. Thank you. I wish you a happy St. Patrick's Day. And of course, Brendan Bartley is one of the great members of the Longford uh, St. Mel's Choir in many years, and we've enjoyed the singing. And so we want to say thank you very much indeed to Brendan, yeah. and happy Patrick's Day to you. Same, same to you, Brendan. Thank you very much indeed. Thank you. And next, next we have coming up here to say send wishes abroad is... Tomas. Tomas, how are you? Not and you're sending wishes to whom, Tomas? Uh, to uh, Brooklyn, New York, and Connecticut. Uh, to Lorraine, my sister, who's in Bayridge. And I want to say hello to all the Irish in the Leaf and the Killarney. And anybody that I've probably missed out on. It's more Irish, there's more love for people over there than there is here. That's true. Mm. Oh, boss, thank you very much and a happy, yes. happy Patrick's Day to you. Now next we have uh, sending wishes to what part of the world are we going? And the name is please? Uh, Helen Masterson. How are you, Helen? I'm very good and happy St. Patrick's Day to you, Brendan. Thank you, Helen, and your happy returns. I'm sending St. Patrick's Day's wishes to my brother Val, his wife Stephanie, my niece Katie, and my two nephews Daniel and Nicholas in Long Island, New York. Also to my lovely aunt Rachel and her husband Ben and their families in New York, Long and Island. And this man's name here is? This is my son. How are you? Hello, Martin Hello. Masterson. How are you, Keepin? Good. And do you see your uh, cousins abroad sometimes, Mark, you do? Yeah, they come over every year. That's good. And you want to send them Happy Patrick's Day wishes? Yeah, Happy St. Patrick's Day. And we'll see tomorrow in June of this year. In yep. June of this year. We're yep. going to have a hell of a time in Longford. Thanks indeed, Patrick. Thanks indeed, Anne. Thank you. We're going to New York in June ourselves. Bring so. me with you. Okay. Oh, thank you very much. <laughs> thank you very much indeed. So next we have uh, sending wishes now to what part of the world are we going to? Come on ahead, girls. No problem. All right, how, how are you, you keeping? Um, I want to send um, St. Patrick's Day wishes to my cousin in, uh, in uh, Toronto, 
and my sister-in-law in London and my cousin in Birmingham. And what's your cousin's name in Toronto? Uh, um, Eileen Melia. Eileen Melia. Yeah. And she'll have a happy Patrick's Day. Hopefully, yeah. And it's good to see you sending your good wishes. Right. Thanks Thanks Thank you very, very much, much indeed. Thank you. Okay, so now we have... Sorry for holding you. I know there's some people here holding on a while, so my apologies on that. Sorry. Just stand beside me, yeah. And the name? Uh, um, it's Aggie Ward. And I want to send wishes to my son in Ottawa in Canada, Finton, and my daughter in Adelaide in Australia, Linda, and her husband, Mark. Thank you very much indeed, Aggie. They're well spread out around the world, aren't they? Anyway, we hope to enjoy St. Patrick's Day, and we look forward to seeing them home. Thank you indeed. And now we have... Oh, we have a man. <laughs> We're getting short in men here. Now, now. So this is Ma Ma Michael Shedwell. And Michael, you're sending which to whom? To Mike, Amber, Natalie, Leah, Leila. Uh, to Daniel and Lillian, and Martin and Tiffia, Tiffany, in all in New York. Yes. Happy St. Patrick's Day. Yeah. Thank you very much indeed. Sorry. I say it to my two nephews, uh, Gary and uh, Michal Ledworth. And also in New York. In New York yeah. Yeah. Thank you very much indeed, and, and many happy returns to, to all. Now, I know we have, uh, this is a great day for musicians throughout the world, and we're blessed in Longford to have some of the finest musicians actually in Ireland. And one of them is a man coming up to see me now. I know he has uh, all Ireland medals for flute and concert playing, and of course, he's one of the great Noel Sweeney. Come on up here, Noel, beside me, and say a word to whoever you want to in whatever part of the world. Just face over the camera there, Noel. Yeah, I'd just like to say hello to my brother, Martin. Martin Sweeney, he's in New York. And of course, his wife Mary, and wish him a happy St. Patrick's Day. And I have also a brother in Manchester in England, Eddie, and his wife Frances, wish them happy festivities as well. Now, I, I know because uh, I'm Noel, is a walking friend of mine, I know that Noel has a CD, go CD out called The Whinny Hills of Leitrim. So maybe someone will buy one or two copies. Hopefully, hopefully yeah. <laughs> Thanks very much indeed, Noel. No, 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 thank you, Noel. That's Noel Sweeney from Longford. I'll go down to you there instead of having him coming up. Um, we just want to say hello to Margaret Gavin in the Catskill Mountains and her family, and to Teresa Kane who's in Dallas, Texas, and to Bridget Kane who's in Norway. So happy St. Patrick's what, Day. What's, what's our baby's name? Anya. Anya is just trying to grab the camera. Yeah. So Anya, I think it's, <laughs> going, it's going to be an entertainer. How are you, Anya? And you're all out, Anya, in your lovely uh, jumper and your green and whatnot. Thank you yeah. very much indeed. Thank, Thank you very much. So, so now, next we have. How are you, Francis? Just face the mic. Oh, uh, no, Francis. Just say hello to my nephew, John Donlan. He's in Toronto, and um, we're just thinking about him. And to all the Davises and Regans in Albany, New York, and my twin is in England and all her family. So just wish them all the very best for today. And maybe they won't hear this, but if they do, we send them our love. But of course, your name is very popular at the minute. It is. <laughs> it is. We're just holding this, Francis. Indeed. Thank you very a great much. name. Thanks. Thank you, Francis. Thanks. Thank you very much indeed. So we're just coming to the end now, we have another one or two people just to uh, say hello to. How are you? And the name is? Francis, Francis, Francis Kelly. Yeah. No, and I, I know Francis because you celebrated uh, this year, I think, was it 40 years? 50. Of Mar 50. My apologies, yeah. 50 years. 50 years. I couldn't yeah. believe it. You're yeah. so young looking. Oh. I've seen you actually come up. I was in the choir. <laughs> yes, uh, but anyway, yes. you want to send wishes to uh, Yes, I want to say um, happy St. Patrick's Day to Nancy Carroll in Rhode Island and um, to Kevin as well. And... Um, to my nephew Malcolm Ainsworth in uh, Hong Kong and my other nephew who's in uh, Toronto in Australia, uh, Frank Lyons, mm. and uh, to all the Maloney family in London and the McCraner family, all our neighbours that are in England, I wish them all a happy St. Patrick's Day. And and congratulations once again to yourself and our husband. I see him there. Thank you very much indeed, France. Well, now we have a man that has just retired recently from the veterinary business. And, of course, he's been many years uh, en entertaining people here in Longford. And he now, of course, is a steward here in St. Mel Cathedral Centre. And uh, I do believe we have our, our good friend here, Mr. Andy Lyons. How are you, Andy? And then how are you doing? I'd just like to wish my son, who's in Toronto, and a very happy Paddy's Day, and a few of his friends out there, young John Donnan and young um, Adrian Murphy. I hope them a good day, and the best of luck for the day. Thank you very much. Thank you very much indeed, and a happy Patrick's Day to you, Stephen May. Thank you indeed. So just to conclude, and sorry, my apologies, Tiernan and Dolan. <laughs> Should the thing wouldn't be right if we didn't have a word of Tiernan. and Tiernan and Dolan has done a lot of work for St. Mel's Cathedral here throughout the years, uh, as a fellow of recording all the different significance events with his camera and whatnot. So how are you, Tiernan? Not a bother, Robbie. I'd just like to say hello to uh, my brother, John, and his wife, Rini, in London, 
and their daughter Rose and of course Miles and every student I ever taught in St. Mel is all over the world from Afghanistan to Sierra Leone and all places in between. Thank you very much indeed Tiernan and happy Patrick's Day to you. So just in conclusion, I'm, I was given some notes here, I'm just trying to see if I can locate them. Uh, there's some notes here for, for the USA from Tina and Larry uh, Reddy, that is, and uh, Farrell, and uh, they want to wish the best, all the best to their people abroad. And uh, can I just say, in conclusion, we'd like to say a special word of thanks indeed to the Longford leader who have facilitated this broadcast th via the net. And we'd also like to say a special word of thanks to Jerry, our sacristan here, has done some fantastic work. And uh, this is yours truly, Brendan Carney, saying, wherever you are, have a happy Patrick's Day. And don't forget, we do have the gathering in Ireland this year. We look forward to seeing you all. So from St. Mel's Cathedral Centre, it's goodbye and slant, slant that. Thank you.